Even in a place designed for peace, violence invades. It's a very scary situation, but I'm just so grateful that no one was hurt. The head of Imagine Inglewood If, Michelle Rashad, says bullets broke a basketball backboard, lodged in a window frame, and hit a neighbor's house last month, all happening on the nonprofit's Peace Campus in West Inglewood. We are a safe haven. We are a space that pours and, and nourishes and nurtures young people so that they can become our next local and global leaders. We are a beautiful place. The Peace Campus offers a community garden, basketball courts, after school activities, and meals delivered or available for pickup in this food desert, plus a lot more. To keep up the support, plus repair the shooting damage and increase security, Imagine Inglewood If aims to raise $45,000 by year's end. We want the campus to be thriving so that we can be able to offer the things that our families need. They had to close down this campus for a couple of days and worked with violence interrupters, and now the staff remains on edge. You know, some days we're still on campus and we can hear gunfire happening the next block over um, and it still makes us really, really nervous. So it makes it really, really difficult to do this work, um, but we know that it's necessary work because um, our families need the support. So they're busy putting up holiday decorations, turning the campus into a winter wonderland. It's very important to show young people that we can transform spaces to be what we want them to be. So it's going to be lots of decor, lots of lights, lots of beautiful memories that we'll be creating for families to celebrate the winter holidays. And hopefully a season of peace. In Inglewood, Sally Schulze, Fox 32, Chicago.